Hey guys, and welcome to today's Fab in Five. So today I'm going to be reviewing the new Merit Signature Lipstick. Prior to this launch, the only lip products they had were lip oils. And so I was very excited to see that they were coming out with a lipstick. So this is supposed to be a sheer lips, uh, lipstick with a satin finish and the benefits of a lip balm without the heaviness of a traditional lipstick. It has squalene and sunflower seed oil to lock in long lasting moisture, papaya fruit extract to soothe lips and raspberry oil to moisturize and add soft aroma. It isn't a tinted lip balm or a traditional lipstick. It's a hydrating buildable formula of sheer satin color that feels so lightweight you'll forget you're wearing it. So you can use one swipe for sheer finish, three swipes for rich color. So I not only was excited about this because I have tested pretty much everything else Merit has to offer and I really have enjoyed a ton of their products. They're a very clean, reliable brand. You know that their products are not only good for you, they're free from chemicals and all different sorts of ingredients that can be harmful. They also are good for the environment, but also the claims on this are just incredible. I personally am not a huge fan of wearing lipstick. I get irritated by the feel of it. It typically feels heavy and like you can tell it's there and I don't love that. So I'm really excited to see if this actually feels as lightweight as it claims to and hopefully it will also wear for a decent amount of time as well. Can we just take a moment to notice how stunning this packaging is? This is one of the most beautiful lipsticks I've ever seen. And then the actual bullet is just to die for as well. I am gonna go in with just this because I want to see how this wears on its own, uh, but obviously you could do a lip liner as well. I'm gonna just do one swipe to see how that shows up and then we will do the full coverage to see how, how buildable it is. My lips are so dry. So they have been so dry since winter started. And here in Canada, the weather is so back and forth. Honestly, it just snowed like three centimeters the other day. It was gone by the end of the day. Like the weather is just insane here. I just can't wait until this dryness is done. I did get it in the shade Baby, which is like a neutral pink. Okay, so that's one layer. Don't mind, I have a little cut on my lip as well from being dry, so that's great. So it feels really, really lightweight, like really lightweight. It's not as hydrating as I thought it was gonna be in terms of like the feel, like that glossy, slippy, hydrating feel. It has more of like a natural, like kind of finish. It's not matte, it's not like dewy, um, but it looks really nice, it feels nice. When you rub your lips together, it feels hydrating. So that's all that really matters. Really like the color. Like this is a beautiful neutral kind of nudie pink. I'm gonna go ahead and build it up a little bit. Um, but also I wanted to mention the way that this bullet is formed where it comes to almost like a point is literally perfect. You don't even need a lip liner. You don't even need a lip liner. Now, if you wanted to apply a lip liner to maybe prolong wear or whatever, obviously there's that, you could still do that, but you honestly don't even need it. So it did build a little bit on the second layer. Let's go in with a third. Yeah, like I would say they're pretty pigmented. When it said sheer, I didn't expect this much pigmentation even from the first layer still feels just as lightweight with those added layers. So I am super, super impressed with this lipstick. I honestly feel like it's it's hitting all the claims so far. I just really, really enjoy it. Um, so I am going to go ahead and see how it wears and I will update you. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay guys, so it has been almost six hours and I would say it's pretty much worn off completely, but it kind of, I just noticed it's worn off and there's maybe a little bit left around the edges. So really good wear for um, a lightweight hydrating lipstick. I'm really impressed and it is one that I think is easily touch, like touched up. Something you could carry in your purse and easily touch it up throughout the day if you want longer wear. So I really am happy with the way that it wore. I'm happy with the way that it felt. I didn't feel it all day long. I wouldn't say it's the most hydrating lipstick I've ever, I've ever tried. Um, 
but it's also not drying at all and it does feel nice and creamy on the lips so Altogether, I'm really, really impressed. I'm really uh, happy with it and I do recommend. So thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next time. Bye.